So here's a way I've come up with uh, being able to control something uh, that draws a lot of current, like a linear actuator with a, a remote control, a standard low cost remote control system. I use a uh, standard servo here and I have it flip a switch, a double pull, double throw switch. And then that in turn drives a relay here. These are 10 amp relays. So from that point, I can pretty much drive anything I want up to 10 amps. I'll show you, uh, turn on the receiver and turn on the transmitter. And you can see, you can watch the switch here. So basically this is one channel, but from one channel, I'm able to control two different functions from it. I can have it do a, uh, drive a motor in one direction, or I could make it do a linear actuator and extend and retract, or I can make it do a motor and switch direction left or right, just by using this right here. And so it takes it from a very low power and low current capability to a very high power and high current capability with the relays there. And these little plastic pieces here, I just have designed them and I 3D print them and they, you, they the servo mounts in there and you can mount a switch in here, a double pole switch. And it's got a flange here that you can screw that to the side of something. And you can also uh, test the feature manually if you want to test the function just by flipping the switch. But I'm using all this to, uh, on a project for my grandson, I'm building a, like a, full-sized uh, metal robot basically and I want to have it be remote controlled and so this is what I've come up with to uh, drive the motors and the actuators and things like that.